In this clip, we are going to define and plan the daily capacity for our cutting machine resource. We have already allocated the group and cost definitions for this resource and defined the unit of measure and runtime calculation. To plan the daily capacity to run this resource, we navigate to the Planning Data tab. The Planning Data tab allows you to capture default data that can be optionally used when defining your actual capacities later in the process. It does not directly relate to your actual capacity data. We then want to input the following. The first factor to determine the daily capacity is based on an eight hour shift, Monday through to Friday. So here we simply add eight. The second factor is that there are two shifts per day. So in this factor, we enter two. And the third factor is that there are three cutting machines available. So in the third factor field, we enter three. Factors 1 and 2 are relevant to a single run capacity. However, factor 3 is not. Therefore, we indicate yes to factor 1, yes to factor 2, and no to factor 3. Single run capacity is the available daily capacity of a single resource unit, assuming a production order can only be produced on one resource at a time. In the remarks field, I'm going to note 2, eight hour shifts per machine, three machines. Therefore, the single run capacity for this resource is a full day of running one machine over two shifts. This is signified by choosing the value yes for factors one and two only. So now we have completed our setup of our new resource master data and we can add this new resource to the system.